what do you mean by absorption to understand that we will take the example of the most commonly used route of drug administration which is oral route mostly we give the drugs by oral route. so if we give a drug orally it will come into the esophagus stomach intestines the drug will come in these areas esophagus stomach intestines and from these areas we want the drug to reach the blood to the systemic circulation so the drug is present here and we want the drug to reach here yeah? so we want the drug from the git to reach the blood so this arrow which we have put this is absorption so in simple language absorption is movement of drug from site of administration to blood so how it reaches the blood is absorption okay now for absorption to occur it is very logical that the drug should cross this membrane the drug should cross this membrane so the drug which can cross the membranes will be absorbed the drug which is not able to cross will not be absorbed okay and on which factor this ability to cross the membranes depend yes it depend upon lipid solubility a lipid soluble drug can easily cross the membrane whereas a water soluble drug will not be easily able to cross the membranes but problem is the same drug it may be lipid soluble at one place in the body it can become water soluble at some other place in the body so on which factor it will depend whether it will be lipid soluble at that place or water soluble at that place